August Complex California fire burning. Before we get into this, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and ring the bell. Make sure and give this video a thumbs up. These are <coughs> videos on California fires that are burning. This is an August Complex fire. It's a big fire. This fire has burnt over 800,000 acres. It's a whole lot of fires combined into one big fire here. It is 30% contained, which is a good, good, but we have a lot of wind blowing right now in Northern California, and the fire is very active, and here fire trucks everywhere still. The fire spans two counties. Current situation, CAL FIRES Unified Team and the U.S. Forest Service are engaged in a coordinated response to take suppression action on the August Complex fire, which has been split into three zones. It's effectively provided a response for the communities at risk. CAL FIRES Incident Management Team ordered the National Guard to assist with fire suppression efforts due to resources drawn down throughout the state. The current acreage of the August Complex West Zone, this is just the West Zone, is over 86,000 acres and is 7% contained. We have our military out there, folks, helping out because we're very short on firefighters here in California. Resources from across the state of California as well as Montana, Idaho, Texas, and New Jersey has been assigned to assist in the August Complex West Zone overnight. The fire remained active in the southern portion, making uphill runs and torching when it was aligned with drainages and topography. The potential for active fire behavior will continue throughout the day. Situation order, Zone AB, south of Middle Fork of the Eel River and west of Eden Creek, north of Salt Flat and east of Salt Creek. Zone AC, east of Bercy Mountain, south of the Fire Road on Salt Flat, west of Eden Valley and north of Bald Mountain. Zone S, south of the county line, east of Bell Springs Road, north of Bell Springs Creek and west of North Fork of the Eel River. Zone Q, south of the county line, west of the north and north fork of the Eel River. Zone Q, south of the county line, west of north and north fork of Eel River and north and east of Bald Mountain Road. Zone E, south of the county line, west of the National Forest Boundary, north of the Forest Highway 7 and west of the county line near M2. Zone N, north of the mid in the middle of the Fork Eel River, including the Eel River Range, Range Ranger Station and the Black Butte Store, west and south of the National Forest Boundary East. Zone D, south and east of Eel River, north of Bentley Basin and west of the National Forest Boundary. Zone C, north of M1, east of National Forest Boundary, south of Forest Highway 7. Zone B, west of Evacuation Zone A, north of Jack Hollow Creek and Thatcher Creek. East of Middle Fork of the Eel River, south of Green Lambert Canyon, through Bentley Basin to M1 and south of M1 to include Timber Ridge and Bentley Ridge and the Hayshed Basin. Zone A, west of the county line, south of Anthony Peak and north of Hole Mountain. Zone F, east of the National Forest Boundary near Garcy Creek, south of Thatcher Creek. Zone U, south of the county line, east and north of East Branch of the South Fork of Eel River, west of Bell Springs Road. Zone T, south of Bell Springs, east of Bell Springs Road, north of Iron Peak and Simmery Road, west of Eel River. Zone R, west of south of Minna Road, south of North Fork of Eel River, east of of the Eel River. Zone L, south and west of Mendocino Pass Road, west of the Middle Fork of the Eel River, and north of Eel River Ranch Road, east of Hill Road and Short Creek Road. Zone K, west and north of the Middle Fork of Eel River, east of Red Wine Spring, south of Hill Road, and Eel River Ranch Road. Zone X, north of Eden Creek, east of Hertz Willis Road, south and west of Eel River. Zone G, west of the county line, north of Eel River and Van Arensdale Reservoir. Zone G, west of the county road, north of the Eel River and Van Arensdale Reservoir, east of the Eel River, south of the National Forest Boundary. Zone AD, south and west of Eel River, north of Foster Mountain Road, east of Ridge West of Willits Road. Zone AE, North of Twin Bridges Creek and east of Eel River, south of Brucey Creek and west of Brucey Mountain. Zone AN, south of Highway 162 and Eel River and west of Salt Creek, north of Brucey Creek and Eel River, east of Highway 162. 
Zone AQ, north of Eel River, south and east of Highway 162 and west of Red Wine Spring. Here are the road closures. Private driveway of Murphy Creek, Bell Springs Road to bound traffic at Luther Ranch Road. Mina Creek Road is closed northbound traffic at the bridge over the north fork of the Eel River. Mendocito Pass Road closure to eastbound traffic just east of the Williams Creek Bridge. Hearst Willits Road at the bridge closed to eastbound traffic. It's a whole lot of road closures out there and a whole lot of evacuation zones. Evacuation order. All areas of North Pack, Saddle Creek, rest of county line, and east of the Lake County line. Evacuation warnings, Pillsbury Ranch. Areas to include North M1, south of Lake County line, and west of Bloody Rock, and east of Lake County line. These are evacuation orders. Mendocino County, Cotillard High School, Southern Trinity, and contact the Humboldt County Fire Information. These are where station places you could go to if you need to have a place to stay. Evacuation centers, Mendocino County, Trinity County, as I stated. Evacuation centers for small and large animals. Ukiah Animal Shelter, Plant Road, Ukiah. Small and large animals, Round Valley Rodeo Grounds, Airport Road, Covito, California. Humboldt County Fairgrounds Street, Ferndale, California. Map. Here's a little map of all the areas showing where the fires is burning down there. It's a big complex fire. Like I said, it's over 800,000 acres. Might hit a million acres before they get this one done. I got future videos coming up here of how many acres have burned in California, including an update on the Creek Fire. Well, again, folks, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and ring the bell and give a thumbs up. And please check back often as I do more California Fires update. Be safe out there and enjoy your weekend.